Well, my friends, I've made it to Mexico and I got Mike with me today, but I'm so excited about this interview, I'm keeping both microphones. He's gonna do a Vanna White for me today, do a little pose, no, I'm just kidding. He gets a microphone as well. But we are in Mexico, we are talking YCM, and why am I so excited? because I've seen what these machines can do, the precision that they create, the micron tolerances at a budget-friendly price. And here in Mexico, budget-friendly is music to their ears. So Mike, let's talk about YCM and your relationship here, a new relationship from what I understand, here with the HEMAC family, but actually under a different name. That's right, yeah. HEMAC um, started a subdivision called Technopro uh, a couple years ago and they were looking to expand their presence uh, in Mexico, as were we. So the, the timing for that subdivision and, and us looking to grow into this wonderful market here in Mexico uh, was just simultaneous and, and great timing. Uh, HEMAC is one of the largest distributors in all of Mexico, and so um, they're leveraging that 30, 30 or so plus year history of, uh, of selling machines into the Mexican market and using the Technopro name now to sell YCM. Well, I'm currently feeling a little bit like Tom Cruise, and he has to stand on boxes in his movies to be the same height. Thank you for that. Uh, so I'm gonna stand on this little platform, but let's talk about the machine itself for the audience. Now, we're here in Mexico. You know the longevity, the history. A lot of the folks out there that have worked with HEMAC for so long realize that that trust and that honesty and that transparency that all the folks here at HEMAC have, and they, they adore that. I know that's why business continues to grow, but this is somewhat of a new product. So let's address the machine. Let's talk to the audience about this machine, how it can benefit them, and then let's move over and show them some of those gorgeous parts over there, because I know this machine can make your medical parts, your aerospace parts, but it's making mold parts, which is discussionably one of the most difficult, highest tolerance, precision, accurate parts that need to be made in all of manufacturing. Yeah, that's a good point, uh, Tony. So the JC-10E, the E standing for our economical model, we really have three versions of this JC-10. Uh, again, the E being the, the entry level, let's call it. Great price point, as you said. Uh, then you step up to the normal JC-10, then we have what we call a JC-10 Plus. Um, so this, this particular machine is really meant for that, you know, uh, entry level shop, job shop that maybe has some complex parts, but doesn't need too many bells and whistles. They don't want to pay, they don't need to pay crazy price uh, for the machine. Um, so great bang for your buck product. And again, like you said, you know, one of the, 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 the greatest selling features or the, the greatest part of the YCM story is their reliability. Uh, you know, we got machines out there in the field, 20, 30 year old machines that are just still running strong. I think you've seen some of them I have and some of your visits with our customers. And so reliability is something that we try to brand into our, our promoting. I mean, it's not what we call a throwaway machine. You know, you could buy a cheap machine, right? But two, three years down the road, you're losing tolerance. You know, you're wondering why you're spending so much money on spare parts. That's not the case with YCM. You know, um, YCM is a unique builder in and amongst ourselves uh, at the fact that we have our own foundry. So all of our castings are done in-house. We hand scrape all of our uh, core components. The foundry being the heartbeat of the factory, you know, and if you don't have a, a solid casting, a solid base of a machine, again, what, what do you have? Yeah, it's a, it's a really great explanation. I wanna slide over and look at some of these parts. And while we do that as well, Mike, let's describe something because you brought it up, you can buy a cheap machine, right? But let's show the audience some of these parts. And I wanna express one of my frustrations as a machinist, but also as someone who wants other people to do well as we look at these high precision parts is, do you know how frustrating it is, Mike, to have a part come off of a machine and how much time is wasted to measure every single component of it because I don't trust my machine, because I'm not sure it's gonna be right. And when I have a trustworthy machine right. like this, I can measure maybe, and I don't wanna give any bad advice out there, but maybe one every five or one every 10, or right. you can do more automated situations. There's just, the stress that goes into not trusting my machine, that I put an offset correctly, did it cut where it said I was gonna cut it, you know, all that comes along with it, the trustworthy machine removes that stress, creates part like this, and for the price comparison of what other parts machines are out there, yeah. I mean, I can't think of any other machines off the top of my head that give us both that accuracy along with that price point. No, you're exactly right. You know, and I, I say it a lot, you know, in, in terms of uh, the sales process you know when you're buying a machine yeah all, 
at the end of the day, you're buying the machine. But really what you're buying is trust. Um, but make no mistake, YCM machines, in terms of tolerance, performance, and like I said, reliability, we keep up with everybody. Um, you know, and we surprise even ourselves sometimes. Like you said, when you went to uh, Zero Tolerance and you yeah. saw Steve's machine. Yeah. He, a guy that was making, you know, very complex molds. Um, easily holding. a world leader. If you've not seen Zero Tolerance in Steve's shop, easily one of the world leaders in mold making. I'll tell you that right now. Yeah. Please continue. Maybe I apologize. you can put a link to, to that video. Yeah, that's absolutely. an excellent video. Yeah. It, he didn't believe his own people. <laughs> right. right. You're making it up. It can't be done this way. So he had to go verify, wow, this YCM is actually performing to that standard. Yeah. So that's what we're capable of. But the question is why? How, how does that happen? I think we've covered all the topics we need to cover. I want to hear the Mexican perspective of all of this as well. Someone who's from, as you can see here, Technipro, part of HEMAC as well. Mike, thank you so much for spending time thank with you, us. Thank you, Tony. We will also do a podcast. I promise the I audience that. I look forward that. to that. Thank you so well, much for being down here, man. Absolutely. My pleasure. Thank you.